Hello again and welcome to Dave's Art Club. Today I'm going to show you how to make a bird out of cardboard and masking tape and paint and some feathers. Uh, so for this you are going to need a couple of pieces of cardboard. You're going to need some masking tape. I use two different sizes but if you have one that's fine. Uh, you're going to need some PVA glue or pit stick but I recommend PVA glue. You're going to need a pencil, a scalpel if you have it, and if you have a cutting board and a scalpel, if not, some scissors, a couple of brushes. So I've used a couple of very small brushes. So I've used the Filbert number four from Art Discount and a number zero, marked again from Art Discount. A piece of cork for the eye. Uh, and I've used a couple of sponges. Sponges are great for getting the texture and also a cotton bud. For this I used acrylic paint but you could also use uh, poster paint. You're also going to need a uh, little jar of water. Okay let's get on with it. The first step is to draw your design on a piece of paper or in your sketchbook. Then draw your design onto cardboard and cut it out. If you have a scalpel and a cutting mat, use that. If not, use scissors, but do use a thinner piece of cardboard than I have used. Once you have the bird cut out, cover it in masking tape. Then draw where the eye and the wing will be. This is to get the proportions right. Then on another piece of card, draw the wing and cut that out and cover that in masking tape. In my palette, I have a cadmium red, a primary red, which is darker, and a white. I use the sponge to mix them on the bird. Using a sponge creates an uneven texture. Make sure you cover the edges. For the beak, I've used a primary yellow with a bit of white. I've made the wing slightly darker. I then use the round sponge to create a pattern. Make sure you tidy up the uneven bits. Using a touch of white creates a nice gradient. I want the wing to be a lot darker, so I've added some purple to the primary red. I want to create an interesting texture, so I put a small amount of orange on a cotton bud. I also added a touch of pink and white. Using a small brush, I dabbed on a mix of purple, red, white in a rhythmic manner.
Then putting some pink on top gives it depth. I painted the cork in white and glued it and the wing on with PVA. I then painted the eye with purple and a black dot in the centre. I then felt it needed a touch of white on the wings. To finish it off, I glued some feathers on with PVA. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please like, subscribe, and also share this video with your friends. See you next time.